Data is getting easier and cheaper to amass on scales we have never seen before. The iPlan Collaborative is a national infrastructure to help scientists solve some of the most pressing challenges of our generation. But equally importantly is to train scientists in how to use that infrastructure to maximum benefit. So Nerev and I teach a class called Applied Concepts in Cyber Infrastructure. This class is here to give students the real world opportunity to solve big problems. And the only way that we can do that is by having real challenges that nobody has solved before. I came into the Applied Concepts in Cyber Infrastructure course with a big data problem and the students in the class helped facilitate a solution to a science project that I've been working on for over three years. So Tyson, working with Nick and the other students in the class, developed a way using iPlant collaborative resources to take existing technology that quantifies energy coming into the landscape and allows users worldwide to compute that variable for their landscape of interest. After the class ended, the students had produced a working product, but we needed to bring that back into the Critical Zone Observatory framework so that we could use it as a, a tool. And so we hired uh, Nicholas Callahan, uh, one of the students from the class, to take the various projects the students had built and bring them all together and then operate under a single working environment. The work that is done here at iPlant has proved to be incredibly useful to me in my work as a defense contractor. And the skills that you learn, learning how to deal with things fast and big data, also really help with defense systems, which are all real time. You need to have a solution in under a second. A unique aspect of iPlan and one of the keys to success is that it's been able to leverage a number of large NSF funded projects to bring together to create the computational infrastructure that is iPlan. We're building and empowering communities that are addressing some of the grand challenges that are facing us today. We've created an infrastructure that can be used across life sciences, and that's because data is data regardless of the field in which you're studying.